Hey there YouTube, Imogen Hearts here, and today I'm going to be doing a look kind of inspired by Rose Chalk. Actually, it's pretty much inspired by Rose Chalk. Um, I don't do it exactly the same way that she does, but pretty much the same way that she does. But um, I had talked about her in my contacts video, and she is someone who is a big inspiration for me. I absolutely adore her makeup. She is phenomenal. Um, her makeup style is kind of the same as mine. I like to go a little bit extravagant, drag queeny, and um, so I pull a lot of inspiration from the looks that I do from her um, and different various variables and things like that. So, um, but my favorite favorite look that she does is this beautiful purple and gold eye makeup look. And um, today I decided to try and recreate it and. Um, yeah, so I hope that you guys enjoy it. This is the look right here. La, 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 la. Mm, 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 uh. Yeah, you get it. You got it. <laughs> and so um, I hope that you guys enjoy this. And to see how I did this look, keep on watching. Okay, so I have started this look off already. Um, I already applied my um, primer. I used uh, my MAC Soft Ochre Paint Pot, and um, I also just right underneath my brow, just to give a highlight um, on my brow bone, I used my NYX Jumbo Pencil um, and Milk. And so now I'm going to start applying the eyeshadows. Um, I'm going to be using Takeo by Sugar Pill and a small shader brush, and I'm just going to take that and um, start packing that on under my brow and stretching that down into the inner corner of my eye and then I'm just going to kind of fill in this um, space between my actual lid and my brow with this white. Okay, so now I'm going to be adding the purple. Um, I'm just using my Wet n Wild color icon palette, maybe. Um, but I'm just using the purple from this. It's like the deepest purple I have that's um, matte. So um, I'm going to use a matte purple for this. Um, and I'm just going to use a regular eye brush. And I'm just going to pack that on my lid first. And then from my lid, I'm going to stretch it up into my crease. Just to kind of get that bridge. And then from there, I'm going to switch over to a fluffy shader brush and I'm going to, or blending brush, and I'm going to just start lightly blending that up towards my brow, and I'm going to kind of create like a flick over here on the outer corner, and blend that back in. And then I'm gonna drag it down here onto my lower lash line. Okay, so the next step to this look is just um, giving yourself that, you know, deep, thick liner. Um, so what I'm going to do is take my NYC liquid eyeliner. For some reason, I have always stuck with this, and I've never really changed to a different one. So I'm going to now line my lashes. And I can't talk while I do this, so, you know, well...
And I'm going to take it down onto my lower lash line. And I'm actually, while that is still wet on my lower lash line, I'm just going to take one of my angled brushes and I'm just going to kind of I'm going to smudge it out a little bit on the bottom. Nothing drastic. And just like a little extra step, it's something that she does with this look, um, is going to put, be putting a point on the inner corner of your lid, so, or your eye. I'm, so I'm going to go ahead and just pull it down here in the inner corner. And create that point. Okay, so the next step is going to be the glitter, um, and I don't have like the color that I want to use. Um, I have like hot gold glitter, but I don't have, um, I like for this look to use more of like, it, this makes silly, like I don't know how to describe this gold other than it's like more of a like a peach or a rose gold as opposed to a yellow or an orange gold if that makes any sense. So um, I have this little stack of glitter here that my good friend uh, Katie gave to me a long time ago and I use all the time. And so I'm going to be using this color. Let me show you both just so you can see the difference, like what I'm talking about. How one's like a hot gold and one is a like more warm neutral gold, if you can see. So this one's like more of a hot gold, this one's more of like a brown warmy gold. So this is the one that I'm going to be using and I just spilled everywhere. <laughs> okay, so I am going to be using um, glitter glue um, by Too Faced and I'm basically just going to squirt some of it out and then I'm going to plot like mix glitter in with it um, and then I'm going to be applying this with um, my angled brush here. So I'm going to take some of the glitter and just pour it out here and mix it together. And then I'm just going to tap that along like the top part of this um, eyeliner that I have created. So it's kind of like a second eyeliner. Um, so you're doing like a stacked eyeliner look here. Okay, so after we've applied the glitter, now it's time for some mascara and false lashes. And as most of you know, I'm horrible at doing that on film, so I'm going to go ahead and shut off the camera real quick and um, at least apply my false lashes and then we'll do some mascara. Okay, so now I have my false lashes applied and um, something that Rose Shock I noticed doesn't do, um, but I have to do or else I feel naked if I don't is um, I go quickly back over my eyeliner um, once my lashes are long. I feel like it kind of hides that little band um, a little bit more so that it's less noticeable that I'm wearing false lashes and I can pretend like they're my real ones. So now I'm just going to take a um, my favorite mascara and um, do a quick coat to my lashes to mend my real lashes with my false lashes um, and then a quick coat to the bottom. I'm just using my Kat Von D um, no idea what it's called, but it's the, it's Cap on the mascara. I love this stuff. I love the wand. I love what it does for my lashes. So I'm just going to start coating these bad boys up. And that is all that you need to do to recreate this beautiful look. Um, I throw on some pink lipstick. Um, it's a little washed out with this lighting. So um, 
that the lipstick I have on is um, Strawberry Milk by NYX. This is my favorite lipstick in the entire world. Um, I don't know why I like I have all my Lime Crime makeup and my Mac, and I just still go back to my NYX Strawberry Milk. It's my favorite color. I don't know why. I just I just absolutely adore what it does to my skin. I don't know. I don't know. I love it. So um yeah. So if you want to see more of me, ha <laughs> ha. Just, you know, subscribe, and then, you know, if you've got questions, you leave them in the comments below, and then, you know, if you want to see what I'm up to in my day-to-day -day life, then go ahead and follow me on Instagram under, as always, Imogen Hearts. And so, I hope that you guys enjoyed this, and you liked it, and, you know, that kind of stuff, so, yeah. I think that ending of the video went great, so, you know, bye!